Hello, Claire here. Now, if you don't know me, if you're new uh, to me and the Amberlynn Files and my channel, I'm Claire Ridgway. I'm the author of books such as The Amberlynn Collection, The Fall of Amberlynn, A Countdown, and co-author of George Boleyn, Tudor Poet, Courtier and Diplomat, and The Boleyns of Heber Castle. And I've written a few others as well. Now, I'm here today because I want your help. Now, you might already know because I've already posted about it that I'm doing a live streamed masterclass on Mary Boleyn, who was, of course, a uh, sister of Queen Anne Boleyn. Now, I'm doing this masterclass very soon on Saturday, the 12th of February, and I'm busy researching it, but I don't want to just do it myself. Um, before I sort of collate my notes, um, my research and plan out my talk, I thought I'd ask you for your input. After all, I'm doing this masterclass. I'm not doing it for myself. I'm doing this masterclass uh, for you to sort of educate you um, about the real Mary Boleyn, who Mary Boleyn really was. Um, and this is the lady here. This is the uh, the beautiful portrait that is one side of the fireplace in the inner hall in Hever Castle, a portrait of matching sort of portrait of Anne Boleyn being the other side. And so there she is. That's the lady that I'm going to be talking about. Now, Mary Boleyn was obviously a key character in Philippa Gregory's The Other Boleyn Girl uh, novel, which was adapted for TV and as a movie. And The Last Boleyn by Karen Harper, which is also a novel. And she appeared as a character in Showtime's The Tudors and Wolf Hall as well. Wolf Hall, the book, and also the series on TV. Um, she's also been the subject of two full-length biographies um, by historian Josephine Wilkinson and then another by Alison Weir, and you'll see those there now. She's a character that, um, that grabs people. Um, there's so many people that are interested in Mary Boleyn, and actually quite a few people that are more interested in Mary than, than Anne, but she's actually you know, quite a shadowy figure. And I think perhaps that's why she really grabs people and piques their interest. And I'd like to ask your help. Um, help me plan my masterclass around you. And I'd actually like you to help me out by sharing and leaving comments on the following questions. So I'm putting it up for you to see. What do you think of Mary Boleyn? Who is your Mary Boleyn in your head, the person that you think you've come to know through perhaps fiction, TV, biographies, history books? So who is your Mary Boleyn? What do you think of her? Number two, what interests you about Mary Boleyn if you are interested in her? What, what really piques your interest about her? Number three, what myths surround her? Um, you know, what, what myths are very prevalent do you always see on social media, perhaps as a result of films like The Other Bling Girl um, and the novel as well, and perhaps The Tudors as well? What, what do you see people saying all the time on social media that, that is wrong? So what myths surround her? And then finally, and this is a real help to me, what questions do you have about Mary Boleyn? So think about those. What do you think of Mary? What interests you about her? What myths around her? And what questions do you have about her? And leave me some answers. No, you don't have to leave answers to all of them, but you know, pick one or two and leave me answers in the comments just to help me make this masterclass um, about you and relevant to you. I really, really want to help you. So please do help me. Now, I anticipate um, this masterclass, um, which takes place on Saturday, the 12th of February, and I'm actually doing it twice that day to suit different time zones. 
I anticipate it being around 90 minutes, um, including the Q&A session as well. And it will be live. It's going to be live streamed. So you'll get your uh, question answered in real time by me. Now, this masterclass on Mary is private and it's a bonus for my um, my event, my online event, um, which is lasting over seven days. It runs from the 28th of February to the 6th of March. I actually might go on a little bit longer with Q&A sessions. Um, and that seven day event, Amberlynn, the woman who changed England, is going to feature talks and live Q&A sessions with eight historians, eight Berlin experts. And we're going to be focusing on the early life of Anne Boleyn. And I feel that this is critical. Um, far too much, you know, the fall of Anne Boleyn is focused on or her romance with Henry VIII. And we really don't consider her early life. And that it's terrible that we don't because that made her the woman that she became, a woman who was so different when she came to the English court in 1522, a woman who made heads turn, um, who caught the eye of, you know, Henry Percy, Thomas Wyatt, and eventually a king. It made her the woman who, yes, caught the eye of a king and who changed, who made that king, because of his obsession with her, change the course of English history. So it's only by looking at her formative years that we can really understand what made Anne the woman she was. And I, along with my colleagues, seven other historians, are going to really bring Amberlynn to life for you during those seven days. And I'm so excited about this because I just, as I said, I feel it's a part of her life that's really, really neglected. So we're really going to be focusing on it. And I've, I'm, I'm receiving the talks at the moment from the other historians because the talks are pre-recorded and then the questions and answers are going to be live. And it's just, oh, they're so fantastic. I'm so excited. Now, to be able to join my Mary Boleyn class, which is a bonus for this event, um, the class that's happening on the 12th of February, you need to have signed up for the Anne Boleyn event, uh, the seven day event, by the end of Tuesday, Tuesday, the 8th of February. So please do make sure you've got hold of your ticket by then. And you can find out how to join the event, Anne Boleyn, The Woman Who Changed England, at my author website, claireridgeway.com slash events. Um, there's a lot of information on there and you can purchase your tickets there. Um, my ma last masterclass that I did in January, um, Who Killed Anne Boleyn, that I also did twice, was such fun. I ended up, uh, ended up being two hours long um, because I had so many fantastic questions um brilliant and lots of really lovely comments afterwards so um i really enjoyed doing that so i'm really looking forward to doing this mary one and then of course um my talks um that i'm doing for the main event which is very soon now i'm really really excited and i do hope you'll consider joining us so please help me with my mary boleyn masterclass by answering those questions i'll put them back on screen now so you should be able to see that, what you think of Mary, what interests you about Mary, what myths surround her, and what questions do you have about her. So please help me out by leaving me a comment. Thank you so much for joining me and for helping me with this. I'll see you very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.